welcome back to charlie's nail art supplies youtube channel i'm joe one of charlie's brand ambassadors um we're going to do a little short video today of i've just recorded a set of these nails for my channel so i thought i'd do um one of these nails just to show you sort of a different technique with uh, foils and using some of charlie's um fine hollow glitters so let's get on I have prepped a tip by popping it on the tip stand and I've just buffed the surface. We are going to go in with some base coat first of all. And I've got a colour out from Madame Glam which is called Neon Sun. Okay, I have swapped my tip stand over from a black one to a, no, not silver, it's gold. But it looks quite battered <laughs> because you could see it through the, um, yeah, through the nail. And I hate that. So we are now matte top coating this nail. So it's had two coats of Neon Sun on. That is going to go in the lamp for 30 seconds. Okay, that's nice and smooth now. I've got some McCart foil glue out. And then all I'm going to do is almost like do a wibbly wobbly line across my nail. Difficult to show you, but basically I've gone round and then back and then forward again so make sure that is properly covered where you've done the line you can use a detail brush to do it if uh, you're unsure okay whilst that is in the lamp I have pulled a piece of this absolutely gorgeous hot pink foil which is from Charlie's I've just got a piece off there so what we're going to do is we're just going to wipe the back of it, which I always do. Sometimes they have like a residue on them, so you're always better off just to give it a wipe and then give it a shake to dry it. Now I do have a few gaps and that in between on this piece of foil as you can see. But whatever it doesn't cover, I will just fill in as I go. And then we're going to put this straight on. Right now, there's going to be gaps, okay? If there's gaps, don't worry. There's no need to panic because we are actually going to cover them up. You can do what I'm doing now by going over the top again. And I'm also going to show you, because obviously there's some dispersed onto that yellow. So what you're going to need is, when I can find it, I've just got this little, it's a small line brush, so it's quite firm. And what I tend to do is give it a quick dunk in my acetone and then pull it off. Get rid of all that. What we don't need. And then we're going to take some uh, no wipe top coat and just seal that in. Pop 
like in the lamp for 30 seconds. Whilst that's doing, I have got three colours, I mean palette. Uh, what's that in there? We don't like that, do we? So in these three, I pulled out these lovely fine hollow glitters. So there's a raspberry. We have got Cadbury Purple. And then we've got the Hollow Gold. Okay, we need a little spoon. Right, these colours that I've got here are Bright Barbie Pink Neon. So I'm going to put that with the Raspberry. This one is because I said so, so I'm going to put that with the uh, purple and then the gold I'm actually going to put on top of Kiss on the Cheek, which is an orange. So, what we're going to do is we're just going to pop a little bit of each onto my palette. And then we want a couple of dotting tools. We need that. So of course that is all sealed in now. I'm just going to push that back. We're going to start off with the gold one. So that is going to go on the orange. Now all we're going to do is random shapes. So we're going to use the dotting tool. So sorry if my tell you what, let me put that down there because then hopefully it won't blind you. So where I said before about don't panic if it's not completely covered, because these blobs are going to go over the top of it anyway. We're not going to go right to the edge, we're going to leave a little bit. But we're just going to pop shapes on. Okay, random shapes, I'm going to pop three on for that colour. Okay, let's move that to the side. And then sprinkle. And what I tend to do is sprinkle it once. And then I sort of check again because it will sort of merge into the gel polish. So I tend to go over it again. Quick tap and into the lamp for 30 seconds. Okay. I tend to wipe with a or flick with a soft brush first of all. So we're going to go in and do the purple now.
Okie dokie. Okay, that's the last collar done. Now, you can. I've been using a soft brush, but what I tend to do when I've finished is go in with one of the hard brushes and just give it a bit of a buff with it because you will get little tiny bits of um, glitter in between, but this will rectify that. Right, hopefully you can see that a bit better now. Can you see the gaps in between? That is just from making sure there's nothing stuck in between. It won't come off. It is sealed good and proper on there. Get rid of all the rubbish from behind. But that is a little... Like you could do yourself a set if you've got some fine glitters from Charlie's and some foil. What I tend to do is, like, I'll pop the colours together. So I'll just hold them together and make sure, you know, they all go. I used the pink one as well, didn't I? So, yeah, I was going to say, you could have done it the other way, where you had a purple background and done the three neon colours. There's so many ways to work it, or done the background with the orange and put those colours together. So just work it around whatever foil you've got and your colours. But I thought I'd show you that little little technique. Move all of those over to there. Um, yeah, it is time consuming, by the way, so just so you know. <laughs> right, I'll leave a photo at the end anyway so you can see it a bit closer. Um, if you'd like to place an order on Charlie's, don't forget to use the discount code. Um, that is there entirely for you. Uh, for your use you can use it as many times as you want so you don't just have to use it on one order you can use it on your following orders um, and don't forget we've got lots of social media for you to follow and the um, support group is really good especially if you want to um, you know you can put some of your nail sets on there or you want to bounce ideas around yeah excellent for that all the ambassadors are on there so yeah please do pop over and join right I'm going to see you next time and I hope you like that. As I say, I'm going to take another photo so you can see it a little bit closer. But it's so sparkly as well. Love it. Right. I'll leave you in peace, guys. Bye.